Now, it's uh, one of the most enigmatic and frightening books in the Bible. It's full of disaster and suffering and that hideous beast whose number is 666. Mm. Six, six. Yes, we're talking, of course, about the book of Revelation. It's the inspiration for a thought-provoking new show in a city centre church. You'll recognise some uh, of the doom-laden voices, the veteran actor Josh Ackland and Julian Ryan Tutt. He's Mac in the Green Wing. And uh, you'll also recognise him from one of the credit card adverts. Oh. Sarah Falkland has the story. He who has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit says to the churches. I saw, coming out of the sea, a beast with ten horns and seven heads, and on his horns ten diadems. Ever since it was written by the Apostle John, the book of Revelation has inspired artists, writers and filmmakers. The descriptions are so bizarre and otherworldly. It, it begs um, all sorts of imaginings. And his number is six, six, six. This artwork by artist photographer David Miles has been ten years in the making. It's for a special show in St Martin's in the Ball Ring in Birmingham. What I've done is to source as much as I can with original photographs. So if I've needed horses, I've got a photograph horses. But then I've loaded those images into the computer and provided uh, a wonderful red horse for the uh, four riders of the apocalypse. And, um, but what I couldn't photograph, I, I drew digitally with a mouse. I heard a sound like a great multitude in heaven saying... Actors have brought the writings alive and the music's been composed by Simon Hall from the city's conservatoire. It was a very interesting opportunity to, to actually work on uh, a text like this and a, a production like this and actually bring together this unique digital imagery um, with hopefully some cutting edge music that uh, people won't have really heard anything like it before hopefully. It's hardly a barrel of laughs this show but there is something rather timely about it. Job worries, money worries, relationship angst. It all kind of pales into insignificance in comparison with Armageddon. Sarah Falkland, BBC Midlands today at St Martin's in the Ball Ring in Birmingham. They've pulled the stops out on that, haven't they? Oh, I think it's going to be fantastic. Very good. No, I think it is as well. And uh, if you want to go and see for yourself, the performance is at St Martin in the Boring, of course, in the centre of Birmingham. Performances start at 8 o'clock every evening, weekday, and at 6 on a Saturday. So there we are.